Now we're talking! Whose car is that? Don't worry, ma'am. I'm coming around. Here you are. Watch your step. Ugh. <sighs> that ride took forever. I'd be honored if you took a flyer! Go! What is this? An invite to a drawing contest? No! Why does there have to be wind anyway? There's nothing in here. Ooh! What's this? A drawing contest? Ugh. Thanks. Give me that. Now look what you've done. Looks like they're both going. Okay. Are we ready for some drawing? Let's warm up with a rainbow. A rainbow, huh? That's one heck of a warm-up. Hmm. I know! My bag of stuff can finally come in handy! Let's see… Oh! Hmm. Aw, hey, little guy! Oh! No! <laughs> Aw, good boy. Here's what I was looking for. Ready for some magic? Watch these colors turn into a whole rainbow. Just gotta make a few blobs. There. Done! Well, almost. Nice! Let's put this thing to work! Is this satisfying or what? It's all about working with what you've got, people! There! Ooh, that's a little messy. Now peel off all the tape. Nothing like a clean, smooth line. Well, make that three smooth lines. Thanks for the help! Pretty impressive, isn't it? I guess it's fine. I got this. Hello? Do I have to do it all myself? So pretty. Go! I need space to get creative here. Interesting. Haha. <laughs> Obviously. Everybody you watch and learn. It's pretty with all the colors, isn't it? Just wait till you see what's next. See? I get to work sometimes. And once that's all finished, you're left with gorgeous rainbow sand. Look at those vibrant hues. Ta-da! That was actually pretty awesome. Oh, I'm definitely not done yet. It's like a little dancing rainbow guy. Gives it a little personality, don't you think? Well? They're both interesting. Which is why you're both winners! Uh, that's fine. Um, is he gonna give us our challenge or what? Uh-huh. Oh! Gadget! Got it? A gadget, huh? Oh, say no more. I know just the guy. <laughs> Aw, there it is! He's so cute, right? But I can make some adjustments. That's good. Now let's get to work, shall we? And start! Yes. Will do. Am I seeing what I think I am? Yep, he's pretty awesome. I know. Now draw away, little guy. But since every artist needs a little inspo, here's yours. Think you can handle a little kitty? No problem. You can always depend on this thing to make the perfect circle. Recognize this thing yet? Just give him a minute, he'll get there. Look at all those perfect lines! What on earth? I don't approve! Can robots even make real art? Looks like it. Ah! Chew! Looks about done! And needless to say, it's perfect! See? Well, two can play this game! I just need the right shapes! Let's see here… Just a little bit of assembly… And there!
just a piece of plastic and a picture on your phone. And poof! You can trace it! Pretty inventive, isn't it? Being resourceful always works out. Almost done! He's turning out pretty cute! I think… <laughs> Lame! So, who wins? For obvious reasons, Naomi! No way! Turns out being creative is the way to go! Stupid robot! You belong in the garbage bin! You hear that?! No. You. Are. The. Garbage. <sighs> what? You drew something for me? <laughs> Is this supposed to be funny? Technology has <laughs> failed me today! Well, now what? Hello up there? Oh, of course. The next round is origami. Phew! Origami? Okay. Good thing I carry paper with me at all times. Just kidding, my butler gave it to me. I prefer paper that's actually worth something. And gold's even better. Here you go. Whoa. Is that real? I'd better get to work. All right, here goes nothing. Things are getting hot in here. Whoa! It turned to gold! But why stop there? In you go! Phew! Oh gosh! Yep, it definitely worked! Fantastic! Mwah! Miss Betty? Thanks, chef. That's so unfair! I wonder if I have some paper lying around. It's not gold, but it'll do. Ready to witness some magic, guys? Yikes. That paper is so wrinkled. Hilarious, I know. But I can turn things around. Just can't leave it on too long. Good as new! Whatever. I've got other things to worry about. Just a few careful folds, and this will look anything like a piece of paper. Now just draw a couple of marks here. It looks strange now, but it'll all make sense at the end. Recognize it yet? It's only the prettiest girl in the world! Huh? Just be patient, will you? I just have a few more lines here. Now for the same thing on this side. Just keep folding flats up and drawing in the blanks. There. All done. If you say <laughs> so. Color, please. Now she can dance. See? I can make all her limbs move. I can't compete with that! Or can I? Just make a fold up top, and again in the other direction. And keep going all the way down. Then draw a straight line here. Then keep it going down this way. Then close it so it's a square. Can you tell what it is yet? And in here, draw a little bunny! How cute is this thing, come on! And he needs a little bear friend. Adorable, right? Don't forget to color things in. Orange and blue always pop. Now for our animal friends. The colors really bring them alive. One last thing. Then fold the paper down. Ta-da! All done! This is tough. But that ballerina… You win! Well, what about my cute creation? We'll pour some milk into this bowl. And now to add drops of food coloring. There's the red. And now for the blue. And of course, we can't forget the yellow. Now I need a cotton swab. 
Let's touch it to the milk. There it goes! It's starting to move! I can make it go in whatever direction I want. Time to do some mixing together. Mmm, I'm kinda bored. I wonder what I should do. I've got it! Time to do some art! I'll start with this orange paint. Art is fun. It's hard to stay bored when you can be creative. Better stay hydrated, though. Oh no! What was I thinking? I have paint all over my fingers! Shoot, what a mess. Now what am I gonna do? The paint is all over the glass. Hmm. Wait! I'm a genius! Alright, time to start with a clean glass and a fingertip of paint. That should be enough. Now I'm gonna draw a squiggle line across the top. Good! I'll add some more, too. Then I can add a little marker underneath the color dabs. I'm done! Yee! It's so cute! It looks like little lights wrapped around my glass. It's definitely a lot prettier than it was before. I can't believe I came up with this! And time for some more juice! Now that's what I'm talking about! Hey! What do you think of my new jacket? I totally got it on sale! It was 50% off! Isn't it just the best? Yeah, it's nice. I get it. But check out my new jacket! What do you think about my new phone case? Sparkles are so last year. I've got poppets. Whatever. I have this notebook, too. I decorated it with stickers. Hearts and stars and one little ice cream treat, too. What? Ugh! My notebook is so boring and plain. This isn't gonna work at all. There's gotta be something I can do. Hmm? I've got these markers. Wait! I think I've got a plan! I've got markers on this knife. I'll cut off the tip. And then I'll make a few more cuts so it'll look like a heart. Aw! Look how cute it turned out! And now to bring out my notebook. I'll use it like a stamp. I don't have to stop at hearts, either. There we go! I've got hearts and stars now, too! See? My notebook has that, too. And I didn't need stickers. Whoa! I can't believe you made that! The squirrel has to give my ice cream back. Not the rocky road. Yeah! Time to do painting! I'm an artist! I'm the best at art! Painting is fun! Oh no! I got paint on your computer! I know! I'll just clean it off! Wait! It's just smearing! Oh no! It's making an even bigger mess! It all just turned pink! She's gonna be so mad at me! Huh? She's awake! Uh, what are you doing? Why are you staring at me? Huh. You're acting weird. Really suspicious. Wait a second! Oh, my laptop! What happened to it?! You painted it pink! Huh? What's this over here? A straw? Wait! I can totally salvage this travesty! Okay, here's my poor messed up laptop. I need more paint. That's right. More, not less paint is the solution. White and yellow, too. And some purple. So pretty. And maybe just a bit of this brownish yellow. Okay, now I'm ready for the straw. I'll start blowing this paint now. I'll use the air to push the paint around the laptop. Gotta keep going. I like the different colors for sure. And the patterns and textures it makes are cool! Wow! It turned into a legit piece of artwork! It's beautiful! Makes me think of waves in the ocean! I can't believe how well it turned out! Wow! Look at her computer! So cool! Almost done stacking my foods! No! It's falling! Shoot! I'm so bad at this! Wait, is that paint up there? Yeah! It is paint! And an easel! She left them out! I'm gonna do some art! Is she around? I don't wanna get caught! Nope! The door's shut! Time for painting! I like this pink color. It's pretty! I'm so good at painting! The best, even! Alright. Got the supplies I need. What the heck? Hi! Look! I'm painting! Isn't it good? Um, sure. I guess so. What am I gonna do? He's already ruined the canvas? Yep. I think I've got a solution! Alright, 
I've got the canvas. A perfect A. Time for some paint. I'll use the color he used. Blue over here. I need more blue and some yellow. All the colors. Time to do some cleaning with the sponge. Just kidding. This is part of the art. I want to use the sponge to dab at all the paint colors. It's okay if I get some on the tape. Turns out doing this dabbing is pretty fun. But it's not really all that quick. Not if you want to do it well anyway. Phew! There we go! I finally covered the canvas with all the paint! Here I go! Pulling off the tape! It comes right off! Wow! It looks amazing! It turned out great! Wow! That's amazing! You're so good at painting! Do one for me! Ah, how did this yarn get tangled? Wow! Grandma, look! Ah! Oh no! My yarn! What a mess! No, 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 no! My art! It's totally ruined! Grandma, look what your yarn did! Wait, the yarn? The yarn! Of course! It's already in the paint after all. I'm gonna do this! All right, the black paint is on the canvas. And now for some gold-painted yarn. I've draped it across the canvas, and I'll do some more over here. There we go. All around the entire piece. Next up, I'll need to tape down the unpainted yarn ends. Ready? Time to pull up the canvas! There we go! The yarn's coming right off! This is an amazing piece of artwork you've created! You're definitely grandma's best artist! It's the best painting I've made! Ah, <sighs> she's so pretty. Time to see if I can impress her with my talents. I'll start with this blue. But I'll also need other colors, too. Definitely gotta fill this heart with pink, of course. There! She's gotta get the message with this painting. I wonder if she'll like it. You made that for me? Oh, get it out of here! Ouch! Nope. I don't want that reaction. Yeah, this is garbage. Wait, what? Oh no! I've got paint all over my hands! This day is not going like I thought it would. Better wash the paint off before I make a mess. Definitely gonna need some soap for this. Wait a second. Wow! Look at this! The suds are colored with the paint! Time to redeem myself! I've got my bowl of water and my dish soap. And of course, I have to add some paint, too. Time to mix this together with a popsicle stick. There we go. It's getting a little sudsy. But I need more bubbles. Time to add some air with a straw. Wow! Look at all of these bubbles! They just keep coming! All right, so long, straw. Now to add the paper onto the bubbles. Just like that. Wow! The bubbles appeared on the paper! Hi! I made you this card. You made this for me? Wow! I love it! It's so beautiful! Oh my gosh! Wanna walk me to class? It totally worked! Anyone wanna enter this contest? Anyone's welcome! Except for you! Get out of here! Gross! Whoa! Now we're talking! Whose car is that? Don't worry, ma'am. I'm coming around. Here you are. Watch your step. Ah, <sighs> that ride took forever. I'd be honored if you took a flyer. Go. What is this? An invite to a drawing contest? No! Why does there have to be wind anyway? There's nothing in here. Ooh, what's this? A drawing contest? Ugh, thanks. Give me that. Now look what you've done. Looks like they're both going. Okay, are we ready for some drawing? Let's warm up with a rainbow. A rainbow, huh? That's one heck of a warm up. Hmm, I know. My bag of stuff can finally come in handy. Let's see. Oh. Hmm. Aw, hey, little guy. Oh, no! <laughs> Aw, good boy. Here's what I was looking for. Ready for some magic? Watch these colors turn into a whole rainbow. Just gotta make a few blobs. 
There. Done! Well, almost. Nice! Let's put this thing to work! Is this satisfying or what? It's all about working with what you've got, people! There! Ooh, that's a little messy. Now peel off all the tape. Nothing like a clean, smooth line. Well, make that three smooth lines. Ah, done! Thanks for the help! Pretty impressive, isn't it? I guess it's fine. I got this. Hello? Do I have to do it all myself? So pretty. Go! I need space to get creative here. Interesting. Haha. <laughs> Obviously. Everybody watch and learn. It's pretty with all the colors, isn't it? Just wait till you see what's next. See? I get to work sometimes. And once that's all finished, you're left with gorgeous rainbow sand. Look at those vibrant hues. Ta-da! That was actually pretty awesome. Oh, I'm definitely not done yet. It's like a little dancing rainbow guy. Gives it a little personality, don't you think? Well? They're both interesting. Which is why you're both winners! Uh, that's fine. Um, is he gonna give us our challenge or what? Uh-huh. Oh! Gadget! Got it? A gadget, huh? Oh, say no more. I know just the guy. <laughs> Aw, there it is! He's so cute, right? But I can make some adjustments. That's good. Now let's get to work, shall we? And start! Yes, will do. Am I seeing what I think I am? Yep, he's pretty awesome. I know. Now draw away, little guy. But since every artist needs a little inspo, here's yours. Think you can handle a little kitty? No problem. You can always depend on this thing to make the perfect circle. Recognize this thing yet? Just give him a minute, he'll get there. Look at all those perfect lines! What on earth? I don't approve! Can robots even make real art? Looks like it. Ah! Chew! Looks about done! And needless to say, it's perfect. See? Well, two can play this game! I just need the right shape! Let's see here… Just a little bit of assembly… And there! Just a piece of plastic and a picture on your phone. And poof! You can trace it! Pretty inventive, isn't it? Being resourceful always works out. Almost done! He's turning out pretty cute! I think… <laughs> Lame! So, who wins? For obvious reasons, Naomi! No way! Turns out being creative is the way to go! Stupid robot! You belong in the garbage bin! You hear that?! No. You are the garbage. <sighs> what? You drew something for me? <laughs> Is this supposed to be funny? Technology has <laughs> failed me today! Well, now what? Hello up there? Oh, of course. The next round is origami. Phew! Origami? Okay. Good thing I carry paper with me at all times. Just kidding, my butler gave it to me. I prefer paper that's actually worth something. And gold's even better. Hmm, 
you go. Whoa. Is that real? I'd better get to work. All right, here goes nothing. Things are getting hot in here. Whoa! It turned to gold! But why stop there? In you go! Whew. Oh gosh! Yep, it definitely worked! Fantastic! Mwah. Miss Betty? Thanks, chef. That's so unfair! I wonder if I have some paper lying around. It's not gold, but it'll do. Ready to witness some magic, guys? Yikes. That paper is so wrinkled. Hilarious, I know. But I can turn things around. Just can't leave it on too long. Good as new! Whatever. I've got other things to worry about. Just a few careful folds, and this will look anything like a piece of paper. Now just draw a couple of marks here. It looks strange now, but it'll all make sense at the end. Recognize it yet? It's only the prettiest girl in the world! Huh? Just be patient, will you? I just have a few more lines here. Now for the same thing on this side. Just keep folding flats up and drawing in the blanks. There. All done. If you say <laughs> so. Color, please. Now she can dance. See? I can make all her limbs move. <gasps> I can't compete with that! Or can I? Just make a fold up top, and again in the other direction. And keep going all the way down. Then draw a straight line here. Then keep it going down this way. Then close it so it's a square. Can you tell what it is yet? And in here, draw a little bunny! How cute is this thing, come on! And he needs a little bear friend! Adorable, right? Don't forget to color things in! Orange and blue always pop! Now for our animal friends! The colors really bring them alive! One last thing. Then fold the paper down. Ta-da! All done! This is tough. But that ballerina… You win! Well, what about my cute creation? What would make regular stuff way cooler? A pop of color, of course. And with the right paint on hand, you can create some serious masterpieces. Who knows? You may create the next Mona Lisa. Or at least a really cool-looking laptop case. Ready to put on your artist hat? Hmm. Hey, what's that? How did that even get in here? Look! That's one beautiful deer! Just look at that thing, Jennifer! That really is something, huh? It's standing? Let's get to work, huh? Just gotta get the right line started. These angles are funky. Ugh, hopeless. I need something more substantial. Bingo! Now I can get the perfect measurements. BRB! Where are you going? Ugh, whatever. Time to get up close and personal. Uh-huh. Looking good. Interesting. Now I know what to do. Let's hit the drawing board. Always start with the black paint. Ugh! It's out already? Ugh! This is ridiculous! Gah! Jennifer! You just ruined my entire piece! That's the least of my worries now. Man! Just look at this mess! 
Oh, I guess I'll start over. Unless… I can use this technique to my advantage. Think this looks too dark? It won't for long. Just blot the paint right onto the picture. Now lift up this layer. Then work on the space above. Two colors are always better than one. Cool, right? Now let's bring in the big guns. Use the brush to flick the paint outwards. It gives a really cool effect, see? Almost done! Run the brush over the trees, too! Even a toothbrush can do some magic! A few skillful flicks are all it takes! Cool! Now peel off this first layer here! And you've got yourself a nighttime forest scene! Isn't it magical? Check mine out! <gasps> How'd you do all that? Well, the winner's clear this round. Well done, Wendy. I really gotta work on my brush technique. Harder strokes, come on! <sighs> anyway… <sighs> okay… Isn't this evening just beautiful? Hey look! Real artists! Hi! Isn't that the cutest couple ever? Uh, if you like that mushy stuff… I love you so much, honey. I feel inspired. I want to transfer this love onto the page. Uh-huh. There. Could these subjects be more boring? I prefer to follow my own heart. One glob of paint at a time. This way, the colors get mixed for me. And you can have fun with the lines. Here comes the color! There! Almost finished with the dots. Now crumble up some aluminum foil and use it to blot the wet paint. This gives it some nice texture. See what I mean? Then go in with the brush and do a little polishing up. What's an outdoor scene without a good tree? Just try not to be too heavy-handed. More blotting! There! Doesn't this look awesome? But we've still got more to do. This color mixing makes it look less rigid. But it could still use a little refinement. See? There are lovers in here. They're just not the main focus. Nice! Now for some rain. Because that's ever so romantic. Ta-da! Is this romantic enough? Mine sure is! How about yours? Eh. Could be better. Do you like it? Wow! That deserves to go in a museum! Really? Guess that makes me the winner! Good job, Jen! Come here! Please? I guess you can have it. It's us, sweetie pie! Ciao! Hmm. My crush has me feeling inspired. I sure hope he appreciates this. Here goes nothing! Uh, what's up, David? Nice. What'd she write to me? Yep. I've got some feelings about this. <laughs> Be still, my heart. Let's see here. Gah! My books! Sorry. Let me help you with those. Oh. So soft. Uh-huh. Wow. Um, my books? Oh, right. So… Yeah. Thank you. I think I'm in love. Wait. Just one last look. Yep. This guy is really something. Ah. Uh, Oh, that's what I'll say. Nothing like reminding your sweetie about the moment you first laid eyes on each other. The hard part's over. Nice. Wow. I remember. Such a sweetheart. Love you, baby. Prepping for your art project is all part of the process. A messy one at that. 
Anyway, time to turn this idea into art. First stroke is always the best. Add a little bit of blue here. It's really coming together. Or is it? This is terrible! Nope! Good thing I have lots more paper! Ooh, smooth. This is worse than the first one! Ugh! Come on now, focus! You've gotta be kidding me. Why can't I paint a stupid flower?! All right. Stay calm. Deep breath in. I can do this. I am fully capable. It's go time. Easy. Easy. Chew! Huh? That was unfortunate. But wait a minute. What an interesting shape! I can work with this! Using your paintbrush in different ways can help you create entirely unique designs. And in my case, petals! Once you've gone all the way around, add some green for the leaves and stems. See how it's all coming together? Careful strokes go a long way. You can even attach these two. It fills out the space quite nicely. I knew I could do it! Whoa! You drew all this on your own? Why don't you have it, Annie? I've got more creating to do. And this time, I'm taking a whole new approach. But don't worry, we're still staying on theme here. See how these strokes make the leaves really come alive? Don't be afraid to take your time with these. You can even make grass, see? But the next part gets a little more complicated. I can use some puffy paints like these to create all new fun textures with a balloon! How satisfying was that? Now use it like a stamp. And you'll get these fun, totally unique flowers. Don't forget this one. Cool, right? Awesome! What do you think? <gasps> David! How did you even come up with that? My secret ingredient! Aw, this picture sure is cheery. Good enough to be framed. And why stop there? Just need some inspo. Mm-hmm. Right. You said what? Oh, Susan, you're bad! Ugh, I don't know. Um, excuse me? My paper! Oh! My bad. Oops. Look what you've done! It's ruined! Hey! Can I show you something? Ever hear of a happy accident? This is one of them. Whoa. Me? Yeah! You can do different sizes, too! Amazing! Let's do it! How many do you think can fit on here? As many as you want! Things are getting crazy! You can use pretty much anything. As long as it's circular, of course. You think we've done enough yet? It sure looks cool, doesn't it? A pie! My little artist. Okay, this spot looks substantial. Yeah? The trees, nature, what have you. The heat is on! You bet! I don't know… What? Hey, stop looking at mine! Whatever, fine. I'll be over here then. What can I paint? Bingo! He's adorable! I hope David didn't see him. I saw it first! 
Uh-huh. May the best bird painter win. A few skillful circles can go a long way. Just have to know where to add the lines. Nice, right? But some color will really make it pop. Yellow is such a happy color, isn't it? It's perfect for such a cheerful guy. And how about some green? Such a peaceful hue. And add some blue for a real treat for the eyes. Doing the edges first is always best. It really rounds things out, doesn't it? Almost done! Just a couple of finishing touches. And that's how it's done, folks! A true masterpiece! Don't you agree? Yep, I'm pretty pleased. What is that? I just needed an extra hand! Turns out, a hand is all you really need. Well, that and a few strategically placed dots and lines. Can you see the bird face yet? Don't worry, it'll all come together soon. These branches ought to give it away. And here are its cute little feet. A little greenery? I think it's quite peaceful. Can you see the bird now? I'm just so creative, aren't I? Well, if you really want to see it… Not too shabby. Oh. I guess they're both pretty great. Should we ask the teacher? Seriously? I hope he's okay. Seems like he's just fast asleep. Hey! Ooh. All done, huh? Oh, great job. Now just give me, uh, five more minutes. Alrighty then. I need something that'll turn some heads. And I know just the thing. Complimentary hues for the win! But it's still missing something. But what? Ugh, this ball is so dinky. Whoa! That thing's blowing my mind! Mom! Oh, not now. Okay. You still have a lot of paint left. Which leaves room for me to play. Thank you! I just don't know what to do. Okay, I'll try a little. Hey! Where did my paint palette go? David? Is that you? Ex Excuse me? Look! I did this! I call it pond water. Uh-huh. Oh! I know. You want to face paint? Give it a try, David. Whoa! Again! Fun, right? You can say that again! Yeah? What if I use my finger, too? Incoming! Ha! Blue dots coming in, people! But now for my favorite color! Woohoo! That's it! Look, mom! Well, isn't this incredible? But let's try one more trick. Symmetry can sure be beautiful! And to prove that to be true, you created it all on your own! It's a gorgeous butterfly! This line will really make it come to life, along with the outline of the wings. Other side! There! Just admire this pure beauty! And that's just the beginning, son! Mm, so sugary. It's really inspiring my art here. What's going on over here? Oh! You know the rules, young lady. No candy! Who needs this much sugar anyway? Oh, what's wrong with this one? Care to explain? Cool, huh? What? I created it myself. Color me intrigued. What's happening in here today? What on earth? Mm-hmm. Oh! The principal! 
No candy allowed. Now for your punishment. No, wait! Whoa! What is this place? Ahem. <clears throat> now that I have your attention, it's time you picked up your utensils. Oh! <laughs> it's a bird call. And your first art challenge. Hmm, let's think. Ah, oh, this scarf. This shouldn't be too hard for me. What? Is that what I think it is? Get out of here, you silly bird! <laughs> At least that gives me a leg up here. In fact, I have just the thing to give me that extra edge. Ugh. How did this get in there? Whatever. As I was saying… Huh? Is this some kind of cruel joke? Okay, finally! My stuff! Oh, great. Another boring book. Not helpful. Goggles? None of this stuff is useful at all. What's all this math? Like I know what any of this means. On second thought, I can use numbers to help me. Once I get the body down, I can use a few magic numbers over here. And on the head, too. It's starting to look like a bird, right? Just wait till the color comes in. You okay there, my little chickadee? I'll give you nice, beautiful feathers. With all the colors of the rainbow. It's finished! What do you think? Can you see the numbers in it? Stunning! And you? I got stuck under some bad weather. This is as far as I got. Ooh! You won this round, Annie. <laughs> Aw, yay! For me? Thanks. Mmm! Mmm-mmm! I can't work under these conditions. I guess I should have seen that coming. Oh. The next challenge is upon us. I've seen plenty of apples in my day. I know just where to start. And the perfect circle is key here. But where am I supposed to put the stamp? This circle takes up the whole page. <laughs> Ugh. Back to square one. Hmm. I could use a little inspo. Wait! I spy the perfect apple! Mm-hmm. She seems good and distracted. I'm going in! Mission Apple Impossible in full effect. I'm armed and ready. A clean, careful cut is all it takes. Huh? What is Annie doing? Knock it off! Sit down! Sorry! Ah, oh, man, I was close too! Huh. Guess I'll just draw what I know. Like the word. Apple. That's easy. P-P-L-E. Wait a minute. If I divide the word by five, or rather, an apple, I get one big step closer to my result. Okay, let's make that five a little bigger. Who knew the number could take up a whole half of an apple? You would never even know that it started out as a number. Especially not when you fill it in. With just the right blending, this thing jumps off the page. Oop, can't forget about the stem. Create a little shadowing. And a few extra little details. And this thing looks good enough to eat! Don't you agree? Ta-da! All finished! Me too. How realistic. And how… Uh, flat. Well, this is a no-brainer. Bravo, Annie. I won! Yes! I wish I had a real apple. Me too. Ugh! Someone already chewed through this one! Ugh! Ha! <laughs> Luckily, mine's fresh. Oh, my sweet, sweet good boy. So handsome. In fact, why don't you two draw him? Now! Oh, it's on! And I'm a doggy expert! It's just a head, body, and four legs. But this looks a little dull, doesn't it? Ugh! Let me try this again. I think bigger's the way to go. Ugh, still bad. Huh. Nope. Still awful. Gah! Ugh! 
Hey! Huh? What? Calm down! Hey, I think I have an idea! I can use my hand as a guide. Because once I have the outline down, I can get creative with all the details. Trust me, this is gonna turn out awesome. See? Now all that's left is some color. And this good boy is giving chocolate brown vibes. Can't forget that pink tongue! A doggy trademark! Ta-da! Like what you see? The resemblance is uncanny! And yours? Uh, Annie? What? <gasps> no drawing? That means you've won, Miss Emma! Ooh, these look delicious! Thank you! Chocolate doggies! I'm starting with this one. Looks good. Mmm, so creamy. No fear! <laughs> Calm down, dear. Just take one. Oh, really? Thank you. Hmm, of course. A little realism is in order. Ladies? Um… <laughs> hey! Oh, sorry about that. Is that a hand we're drawing? Okay, fine. I have a plan. Let's see. This hand could work. But this one is way better! Yep. Talk about lending a hand. All I have to do is trace this thing. I've got this round in the bag. Hey, look! One moment. Seriously? Okay. This thing's kind of fun. Actually… I know. Good girl! Huh? Annie? Huh? Well, that was odd. Got any wax in there? Huh? Knock it off, I'm trying to work here! Ugh! Wait. You know what? This may come in handy. Art is all about inspiration, not copying. And those twisted fingers got my brain going. Can't go wrong with red nails, right? This thing is really coming together. All finished! Where'd she go? Oh, anyway. Hey, hands up! Okay. Whoa, how'd she manage that? Mine looks so lame next to hers. Meh. Oh my word! Stunning! Who's she waving in? Just my prize is all! And wow, this one's spectacular! I'm the art queen! Jealous? Good job! Don't even think about it. Howdy, folks. Think you can draw this? Now get going! Psh, this is gonna be a piece of cake. Pink's the name of the game this round. Oh yeah. First comes the paper cup. Bubblegum Pink's my fave. Oh, she didn't even consider sizing. I'd say that's about five inches. Hmm. And now on to the yummiest part. So good. But maybe green was the wrong choice. Oh. Yes? Is that supposed to be ice cream? Whoa! I didn't mean to draw this! You want a green, right? Amateur mistake. I say the more realistic, the better. Starting with the big, creamy scoops. Color should always come second. You create a better foundation this way. See what I mean? You can't go wrong with all the little details. See? Ice cream! It's written right on the cup! And now it's finally time for some color! All this ice cream is making me hungry! That's what happens when you get real with what you're drawing! Almost done! Just a few more details here! And there! I'm finished! Feast your eyes on this! Huh? Oh, let me see here… Now that's what I call a masterpiece! Here! Yeah! Whoa! It turned into a real bucket of ice cream! This may be the best prize yet! Mmm! 
Ugh, this is torture. I don't even like broccoli. Ugh, it tastes like a tree. Hmm, I need some inspiration. This is making me hungry. Oh, I know. I always come prepared. Are you kidding me? What? I need to eat? You always think with your stomach. Mom, do something! I'm sorry, honey. This won't take long. You can't rush perfection. I'm so bored. This isn't fair! Can you hurry up? Emma's upset! Give me that! Get your own rice! No! Look what you did! We'll talk about this later. There's rice everywhere. Hold on. This gives me an idea. I'll put some drops of food coloring into a glass of water. Then I'll give it a stir. Now I'll add rice. Next, I need this glue. I'll apply the glue to my drawing. I'll only put it on the grass area. Then I need my rice. I'll sprinkle the rice over the glue. I can use different colored rice for different parts of the drawing. Now I can blow off the excess rice. Wow! It looks good enough to eat! What do you think, Emma? <laughs> huh? Wow! I love it, Mom! What about you, Dad? Huh? Do you say something, Emma? Wait, what's going on? There's only one thing for it! <sighs> the things I do for my family. <laughs> Dad looks silly! I'm not finished yet. I need some paper. Check this out! It's a self-portrait! <laughs> it's great, but… Mom wins this round! Thanks, sweetie! You don't need to clean your room now! Woo! This is fun! Ooh, what's this? Just look at her. Emma, put that down! Nah, nah! Stop it right now, young lady! Are you listening to me? Uh-oh. Her eye is doing that weird twitching thing. That's trouble. Uh, take it easy. Try this. Give me that! Uh, I can feel the tension melting away. Ah, that's better. You just get me, dear. Wait! I think I can use this! I'll start by drawing a tree. You gotta love nature. This black pen is perfect for the branches and trunk. That looks good. Now I'll take a small square of bubble wrap and dip it in paint. I'll mix the pink and white. I'll dab it over the drawing. It gives the impression of leaves. It's a beautiful blossom tree. Do you like it, Emma? Oops. <laughs> Silly me. Wow, mom! It's amazing! Hey, maybe I can use this too. I know what to do. How do I look? No one say better looking. I'm a work of art. Are you for real? It's great, Dad! The winner is… Mom! Again? Wow, what an honor! Really? Let me pop that bubble! <laughs> What's that smell? It stinks! It's getting stronger! Ooh, I might have known! What's wrong? That's my natural odor. It smells great! I have just the thing. Use it. A lot. Fine. At least you won't smell. Thanks. Oh, it's like the night we met. My personal hygiene was bad that night, too. It was so romantic. Give me a kiss. Like I would ever say no. Yuck! That's so gross! Huh? Oh, uh, hi, honey. Sorry. Hmm. Now what am I gonna do? Wait a minute. I think I have an idea. Listen to this, dear. What are they doing? Got it. Let's get to work. First, I'll take the deodorant apart. Just like this. Now I'll fill the container with paint. Then put the roller back on. When I press it on the paper, paint comes out. It's just like a paintbrush. And it's great for creating art. Look at that! It deserves to be in a frame! Look at this! It's wonderful! It's a joint effort! Whoa! 
what? We can hang it in the living room. It can replace the photo of grandma. Behave! It's a tie! Well deserved! That deserves a quick kiss. Ah, I'm so sleepy. Emma! Yoo-hoo! <laughs> Classic mom. I'm just gonna close my eyes. Look! I can touch my nose with my tongue! See? What a talent! Can you do this? I've got my eye on you! Oh my! Pink suits you! I feel so alive. I could get used to this. Great, dad. Keep the noise down. I'm gonna catch up on my beauty sleep. I thought that would work. We tried our best. Oh, how about some shadow puppets? Shadow puppets? Pretty impressive, huh? Why didn't you start with this? It's so entertaining! Breaking out the old shadow puppets, eh? It doesn't look that hard. Oh, I have an idea. I'll place my hand on the paper. Then draw around it. Now I just need to add the finer details. Like some eyes. It's a dragon! But he isn't finished yet. He needs some color. Can't forget about the flame. Check this out! <gasps> wow! I thought you'd like it. I'm gonna try some balloon art! It's a dog! Hey! Stay back, boy! Run away! What a show! You both win! Look! Oh, amazing! I want my hair to look pretty. Hmm, I know. What are we supposed to do with these? I know. I could use these pencils. And one of these hairbands. I think this might work. I'll wrap the hairband around two pencils. I need to make sure they are secure. I'll attach a second pencil at the other end. That's just what I want. I'll put one pencil over this cupcake drawing and then trace around it. The second pencil will make a copy. Look at that! Now I just need to color it in. I'll make sure I stay in the lines. This is going to look great! There! I'm finished! Do you like it? That one's mine! Let me have a look at that. Wow, that's pretty clever. I wonder what I can do. I'll join the pencils together. And use them as a catapult. Take that! Careful! Stop it! Ouch! Ow! I feel dizzy. Oh, uh, you sort of deserve that. <laughs> nice shot, dad! There's one clear winner! That's so nice, honey. Where… where am I? Oh, you're such a joker. Ooh, these crayons are nice. Here, mommy. Good throw. I got it! This is too easy. Oh, I might have gotten a little excited. They're all broken. <laughs> Good luck with that. It's alright, I've got this glue. I'm great at DIY. They'll be as good as new. Let's try it out. Oh, uh, pretend that didn't happen. Don't worry, I have a backup plan. I can use this. You're kidding, right? Not gonna work, dad! At least I'm trying. There's only one thing for it. Honey, uh, put the hammer down! I know what I'm doing. Wait a minute. I have a better idea. I'll scatter the chalk over this butterfly template. Then place a plastic sheet over the top. Now to work out my tension. This is my kind of art. We need to talk later. I'll focus on my art. It's not too bad. I'm finished too. I'll remove the template. It looks good. Do you like it? Or do you like my watermelon? Ooh, this is tough. It's a tie! I'll take it. Well done! <laughs> I heard there's a special place where all magical beings roam free! 
Wouldn't you die to meet a real live unicorn? Is the sky blue? Shall we? Look at all the colors! And that magical horn! What's going on? And look at these outfits! Pretty and pink for sure! Blue raspberry is my jam! Madison, look! Wow. You're looking at me, girl. Don't you love my sparkles? You'll love this challenge even more! Ready to draw? We were born ready! First step in our drawing challenge… Meow! We love cats! They're simply the cutest! Eee! Girls, we're drawing, remember? Should I make mine a tabby? Sit still, okay, little guy? Is this even accurate? Now we're talking! I want my proportions to be right. It's still not right. These can work. Just need a pinch of fur. Good thing I'm wearing goggles. Let me look at my calculations. Yep, just as I thought. What's Annie doing over there? The results are in! It's what I suspected all along. No more science! It's time to get artsy in here! Time's up already?! Show us what you got, girls! Don't be shy! Very nice, Madison! Could you please? That is really good! I'll show you how to do it! You'll see that every day. Start with the word cat. Then build off the letters. You can add colorful details, too. Don't forget his little face. And some stripes look good, too. They kinda look alike, don't they? Time for another spin! Hearts are our favorite! And we have the perfect models! One, two, three, go! So handsome! He has my heart all right! <gasps> That's my David! Your David? Well, this is awkward. Don't fight, girls. There's gotta be a way to settle this. Hello? You give me no other choice. And poof! Not so handsome anymore. Sorry, girls. He's mine! Huh? Has he always looked like this? What was I thinking?! Ugh! His smile looks different. I hate to judge. Oh, right! Hey, Annie! Is that David? I look okay? Where? Ha! Sucker! Don't see him? Where? My markers are all gone! Madison, did you take them? Well, that wasn't very nice. Try to steal her stuff now! Is Madison frozen? Oh, these are mine! Thank you very much! We're drawing hearts, right? To make a perfect heart. Enclose it in a rectangle. And add stripes with a ruler. Then curved lines in the heart. You can use different colors. 
Outline the heart and make it nice and dark. Now make both sides match. Use white to make a sheen effect. My heart's finished and it's 3D! And unfreeze! But I didn't draw anything! This chair is incredible, Annie! So cool! Sorry about the theft. For me? Thank you! As long as I have David. <laughs> okay, girls. Here we go! Now it's your turn. We're drawing hands, huh? Interesting. I have an idea. Check that out! The best idea ever! Now, that's better. And we have light, ladies and gents! Let's do it! First, trace your hand. Then turn your hand into an adorable little bird. Color him in with a white chalk pen. Don't color the wing just yet. Okay, now you can! And don't forget about those little feet! I don't know how to draw this thing! Huh? That looks stupid. Anything? I just don't see it! Ha! That's the one! Oof! My aim was a little off! Let's try this one! Trace your hand like this. Then turn it into a cute little doggy. Doesn't look like a hand anymore, right? Check out that giant tongue. Then give him brown fur. Time's up! Check these masterpieces out! Those were your hands! Incredible! And your duck is just fantastic! Truly remarkable! Perfect! How do I choose a winner? They're both so wonderful! Two judges for two deserving winners! So we both won this round? Okay, you ready for this one? Let's see some giraffes! How do I do it? Ugh, oh, that's a piece of cake! I could do it in my sleep! I know! Start with a head like this! Now just a few more lines! I got it! Just a quick snack first! So fresh! Phew! That mall was huge! But I got the inspiration I needed! First, draw these four numbers. Look at this little guy! And here's a swan! A beautiful butterfly! And lastly, a fish! Now it's time to color them all in! He's cute, right? And this one is super elegant. Don't forget the water! A pink butterfly? Adorable! It's all about the little details. Now onto the little fish. All right, time's up, girls! I drew four animals! Including the giraffe, of course. Incredible, Madison! Annie? Just one more second, okay? I can't draw fast enough! Done! That's… 
Interesting. What a sad excuse for a giraffe. You both are wonderful artists. And you made this unicorn smile. Hey! Look at all these sparkles! Farewell, Miss Unicorn! Wait! Madison, wake up! What? I dreamt we met a unicorn! Are you okay? Is that weird? It just felt so real. Yep. No more blue hair, huh? I'll just head back to bed, I guess. Maybe I'll dream it again. <laughs> you and your dreams. Ready for today's lesson? It's going to be a good one. I can't wait! Here's the first word. I want you to write it down. Go ahead. This should be easy. That's it. Concentrate. And I'm done! What do you think? What? What is that? Let's try this again. Try the letter R. You got it! I can totally do that! That's the attitude. How's this? Oh, I knew teaching wasn't the profession for me. Wait! That conveniently placed coat stand has given me an idea! This will change everything. I'll start by drawing the letter R and then shading it in. Next, I'll draw a pretty flower. Then a face. And the body. That's looking good, but it needs some color. Art class is much better than spelling. I should do this more often. Now I need some raindrops. Think you could draw the outline of the coat? Wow! Yeah! I'll give it a go. This is so much easier. Whoa! That's amazing! Are you seeing this? Great job. I knew you could do it. And this is for you. Is that the best you've got? Huh? Wait! I'm about to bring the pain, Jared! It's time for today's lesson, class. Stop the nonsense right now. Shall we begin? Today I want you to draw a picture. Ooh, exciting! Boring. Hmm. What's Madison doing? I can't think of anything. I mean, art is pointless. I suppose I better do something. There's so much paint to choose from. Ugh, this is so frustrating. Hold on. You're finished already? Come on, think. I've got it. I can use my chain. I've painted a canvas with white paint. I'll arrange the chains at different positions and angles. Then I'll drip colored paint onto the paper. I'll alternate it around the edges. Then I'll pull the chain through this metal ring. They'll move the paint. And create a unique pattern. I know, it's pretty awesome. You can applaud now. What are you talking about? Whoa! That's so cool! But… Uh, my unicorn's prettier! You know that, right? Jared! The use of colors! The emotion! I knew there was an artistic genius in there! Meh. It's okay, Madison. Here are your grades. I think this is fair. Bravo, Jared. Bravo! But… but… I'm the talented one! Not anymore! Big love, Teach. Big love. What is taking so long? Come on, hurry up. I can't wait around here all day. Coming through! Oops. There's a wall here. <laughs> that tickles. I love the dentist's office! Jared, be quiet! Huh? What'd you say? Oh, stop it! Can we come here every week? Ah! Jared, don't do that! Ooh, what's this? It's so soft and fluffy! It's like getting a hug from a teddy bear! Oh yeah, work it! Not so fast, young man. Sit down. No more mischief, got it? Let's draw something. Ooh, I do like drawing. Watch this, sweetie. Whoa. 
I'll start by drawing small lines on the page. I'll use different colors and arrange them in a circle. Now I'll add a black dot on top of every line. Next, I'll use a thinner pen and draw smaller lines. It looks like a group of people. I'll make them hold hands. I can use a pencil to add shadows. Rubbing the pencil gives a better effect. What do you think? Pretty neat, huh? Wow! That's so cool! Now it's your turn, honey. Sorry for the wait. Ah, oh, there you are. Come on in. Ah, oh, can you give me a… Never mind. I've gotta go. Come on, sweetie. Slow down, dad! For the contest! I need to be perfect! You're so talented, sweetie, but come on! We need to go! The clock is ticking! Don't pressure me! Dad, wait! Whoa! Oh no, my little girl! It's okay, daddy's here. It's not! My drawing is ruined! Look at it! Yeah, that looks terrible. What about the contest? What time is it? Ugh. Think, there must be something we can do. I know. It's dad to the rescue. I'll draw a picture with both pens. It'll be like a mirror image. I never knew I could do this. There, I'm done. It's pretty good, huh? Whoa! I love it, dad! Now get in there. I'm right behind you! I'm here! I'm here! Wow, I can't believe it! I knew you could do it, honey. And it's all thanks to my amazing talent. It's time to create my next masterpiece. That should be enough paint. Now I'll spread it out. Hi, sweetie. That was a great shower. I better dry my hair. There's nothing like the wind blowing through my hair. Sha la la la, huh? Mom, be careful! I might try a new look. Hey, watch it! I like that hat! Ooh, this is looking good. Why would you do that? Do you have any idea what you've done? This is a That's better. This is all your fault. What am I supposed to do now? Oh, sweetie, I'm so sorry. I didn't realize. Don't worry. I'll make things better. I might have an idea. Check this out. I'll pour acrylic paint onto a canvas. I'll pour it in a circle, and I'll use different colors. Then I'll use the hair dryer to spread it out. This will create a wave pattern. The paint will mix and create something special. Mom, it's amazing! I know, dear. But I couldn't do it without the hair dryer. Wow, it's so clever! I'm inspired! I'm gonna paint something! That's the spirit. Uh, not so fast, mom. I'm gonna need this. Oh, uh, that's okay. I guess it's going to be a bad hair day. This cake shouldn't take too long to bake. I suppose I should clean up. Mom, mom, look! We should go on vacation! Just look at those golden sands! What do you say? I could use a vacation. I just need to check one thing. Hmm. I'm a little short. I mean, there's the flights, the accommodation… Nope. That's not gonna happen, Jared. Aw, it's so unfair. It's fine. I'll just imagine I'm on a tropical island. I'm sorry, honey. I have something for you. Maybe this will cheer you up. Have a look at this. It's a shell from the beach. Wait. It is pretty. But you're not gonna buy me off with a shell. I thought that was gonna work. Now what am I gonna do? There must be something. Hang on. 
Maybe I can use this aluminum foil. I'll put paint on a canvas and then scrunch up the foil. I'll dab the foil onto the paint. This will mix it together and give it a textured effect. Then I can add some more details, like these shells. It's just like being at the beach. I can almost hear the waves lapping against the shore. Jared, look at this. It's pretty tranquil, huh? Wow, it makes me want to work on my tan. It's great, mom. But it's not a vacation, is it? Wait, I have another idea. It needs a for sale sign. And now we wait. Aha! Uh -huh. A gullible, I mean, willing customer. What just happened? We're rich! That means we can… Oh my gosh! This is the best day ever! You're the best, mom! Wait for me! You need to start painting when we get home. I'm already planning our next vacay. Ah. I'm so excited for class. I'm not. It's test time. I love tests. Especially when it's art. Ooh, Claire's keen. I'll do a self-portrait. I'll start with the outline. And then I'll color it in. I'll draw at different angles to give the hair texture. This is gonna be so good. This color is perfect for skin tone. Then I'll add details to the clothes. I'll use a white pen to color the eyes. It just makes it look better. Can you do me? Of course I can. Don't move. I'll just follow the same process. I've really nailed the hair. Now it's time to color it in. You're gonna be so happy with this, Leo. It'll be like looking in a mirror. I'll give you some colorful clothes. This is making me happy. Almost done. There you go. Whoa, I love it. Huh? They're ours! Stay back! What? What are you doing? No! You're tearing it! What have you done? What? What's happening? Ugh, sorry, you scared me. It's a drawing challenge. Okay. You really suit that look, Claire. I love your lipstick. I could watch you all day. Uh, are you feeling okay? Hmm. You want us to do something symmetrical? I need to impress Claire. How's this for a makeover? You look weird. Oh, I have an idea. Look at that. It's given me a great idea. I'll need these scissors. I'll fold a piece of paper. And then cut a small section from it. I'll fold the paper over and start drawing. I'm gonna draw a blue monster. But I want to do it over the fold. Now I'll open the paper up. And I'll draw in the blank space. I'm gonna draw a human face. Then the body. I'll add some small details. Just like this. Now for the fun part. This is gonna be like the inside of the head. I want it to look like he's stretching. I'll obviously need blue ink. And then flesh-colored ink. I'll use yellow for the crown. This is looking great. I just need to color the last few parts. And I'm finished. If I fold the paper over, it looks like a normal drawing. But it's hiding a surprise. Okay, it's my turn. I'm gonna fold the paper over. And I'll draw a love heart. Then I can color it in. I'm using red, obviously. I just need to stay in the lines. Hmm, these gloves feel nice. Once that's done, I can open the paper up. I've sketched a cute couple kissing inside. I like to pretend it's Claire and me. I'll go over the pencil with black ink. I just need to follow the lines. Then I'll add color. I'll give the girl black hair. It's supposed to be Claire, after all. I hope she takes the hint. I want it to be perfect. This will be my love letter to her. It looks just like us. Look how happy we are. I'm such a romantic at heart. I can't forget about the mini love heart. That's it! It's so adorable! Just like Claire. It makes me all warm and fuzzy inside. Look what I've got. Watch this, Claire. I think I'm gonna throw up. Maybe we could reenact it sometime? Have a look at this. Aw, that's nice. Ah! Make it stop! Phew, it's over. Ah! I could do this all day. See? Even Thing is laughing. Okay, that's enough. Why? Why would you do that? 
Come on, I've got to win! Wait, look! I won! Seriously? You got a problem with that? Look, Claire! I think they're falling in love! It's beautiful! I hate it. Wait, something's happening! He got dumped. Ooh, a free flower! It smells amazing! Like a summer's meadow. Is this the next challenge? Claire, I want you to have this. Get it out of here. Not a fan of flowers, huh? Only when they're on a grave. Now can I get on with my drawing? She loves me. She loves me not. She loves me. She loves me not. Can you keep it down? I think I'll start with a love heart. Then I'll draw triangles inside. Then I'll draw a loop around the bottom of the heart. It's transformed into a rose. Now I'll draw the leaves. And finally, the stem. I'll use a pencil to add shading. But this rose isn't gonna be red or pink. It's gonna be black. It's the best color. I'll apply more pressure when coloring the outer petals. This will make them darker. She loves me not! Wait. She loves me! It's a sign from the universe. We're supposed to be together. Wow. That gives me an idea. I'll be right back. She loves me not. She loves me. I want that rose! True love depends on it! Wow! Take it, buddy! This is just what I need! And this is what I need! Woohoo! Okay, just relax. <clears throat> Claire? What is it now? This is for you. Hmm. Let me see it. It's pretty. She likes it! Mmm, nom, 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 nom. delicious. I'm done with this. Uh, okay. You wanna see our drawings? Here you go. It's black. Like my heart. I didn't do anything. I guess that's fair. Meh. Like I care. Kiss me, Claire! Never give up. Get out of here. Aw, you're mean. What's it doing? I'm so confused. I think it's supposed to be a shadow puppet. Ooh, I love those! It's tragic. That's what it is. Nope. It's not any clearer. It's a dog. Why didn't you say so? Hey, Claire, look! Trick shot! Pretty cool, huh? I know she's impressed. I'm really not. Let's get this over with. What's he doing? I'm gonna draw around my hand! Please stop talking. I'll show you. I'll place my hand on the paper like this. Then I'll draw around it. It won't look much to begin with, but just wait until I add the details. I'll start with an eye. And then a cute little nose. I'll fill it in black. And I'll do the same with the other eye. And I'll do the same with the eye. I'll leave a small white dot. That'll be the light reflection. Then it's time for the fur. And it'll need a collar. We don't want it getting lost. Please stop singing. I'll only sing louder! It's so bad. Drawing a little doggy. I can't take it anymore. You're making me so mad. I'll crush you. Each note is piercing my brain. Make it stop! Ugh. Look at what you've made me do. Hold on. I think I can work with this. I'll start by spreading the chalk dust out. You know, that feels good. It's pretty soothing. I can feel the tension melting away. I'll draw an upside-down love heart, then two small circles, and a triangle. It's already looking like a dog. These will be the ears. I'll give my dog brown fur. This is the easy part. I just need to stay within the lines. I wish every drawing could be like this. It's almost done. Now for a big red tongue. I wish I had a dog. It would be my best friend. We could go for walks all the time. I better focus on what I'm doing. I think I'm done! It looks pretty good. No, it doesn't. Come on. I have to win this round. I used my hand as a template. Can you see the resemblance? I can't pick mine up. Yes! I won! I'm the greatest! Nah, nah. Don't push it, Leo. Oops, sorry. Ugh, I'm so angry. What's next? What do you think it is? Sorry for asking. Look, a pretty butterfly. 
Wow, it's so magical! I wish there was a spider web. Something's about to happen! Thing is catching the butterfly! Is it okay? I hope not. So we've to draw a butterfly? It's so exciting! Stop it. Let's go! I think that's my paper. Huh? Oh, okay. Come on, hand it over. What? No swapping? Listen to the hand! You don't want to mess with it. Hmm. I have an idea. I have a butterfly stencil! Whatever. I'll need my chalk. I'll use the knife to create shavings. And I mix up the colors. I'll work my way across the page. I'll make a rough outline initially. I know this is a little bright and colorful for me, but it'll be over soon. This is the last color I need. Now I need to get my finger dirty. I'll smudge the chalk dust and start to create a butterfly. Then I'll place the stencil on top. That looks about right. Did you really think I wouldn't use black in this drawing? I'll shave the chalk over the stencil. I'll cover the whole page with it. Then I'll smudge it with my finger. It's gonna give a great effect. I'll take my time around the stencil. I'll use my other hand to hold it in place. I don't want to ruin it now. Now I can remove the stencil. But I'm not finished yet. I'll draw something inside the butterfly. It's a tranquil landscape. My turn! I'll place the stencil on the paper. And then I'll draw lines with chalk. I'll work in sections. And then switch colors. I'll do this all the way around. It's gonna look great! I'll go over the chalk. I want it to look so vibrant. I'll hold on the stencil the whole time. One slip and my drawing's ruined. Now I can remove the stencil. Look, it's flying away! It can go here. Now I'll draw a dotted line in the blank space. It'll be the trail of the butterfly. It's so colorful! Just like a butterfly! Here's my drawing. You better like it. Look, Claire! It's a tie! We're both winners! That makes me so happy! Whoa! Look at that! Beat it! I'll repel you with my dance moves! Ooh, nice moves, Claire! I guess we're creating a rainbow. I love rainbows! Nope. That's not gonna happen. Anything but that. I can't wait to get started. I'll need my gloves. Things are gonna get messy. I'm gonna keep it simple. Huh? Why are you so animated? What's wrong with a black pen? Get out of the way! I mean it! Stop it! This is getting annoying! You're gonna regret this. I didn't want to do this. But it's your own fault. Don't look at me like that. I warned you. Maybe I can get started now. I'll draw a large cloud. That's just what I want. Now I'll hold it above my head. Ah. That's good. I'm gonna enjoy this. I'll cover the page with different colored paint. Then I'll take this love heart puppet. And I'll press it into the paint. I want to make sure it's covered. Then I'll peel it off. Now I can place it onto the canvas. I've covered the canvas in tape, except for the heart. I don't want to mess it up. Now I can lift it off. It's good, but it's not finished. I'll run a brush over it. Wow! Look at that! It gives a great effect! I'll do the rest. I've dipped a toothbrush in white paint. I'll flick it over the heart. Next, I'll dip the base of a glass in white paint. And I'll press a glass in the center. Once it's dry, I can paint a tree on it. Hmm. I'll add some birds. It definitely needed something else. Now I can finish the tree. I'll use the toothbrush for this. It gives the impression of leaves. It's done! I can peel the tape off the canvas. Wow. This is a work of art. I love it! Uh, do you need an umbrella? I'm not finished. That's more like it. You need help. Pick me! Yes! I knew it! I win! Look, Claire. Ow! Well, I better get ready for class. Whoa! This is so cool! Hmm. What hairstyle should we choose? Not green. I think I know! We'll go for number three! Ugh. What is that supposed to be? Let go! It's mine! I want to see it! Whoa! What happened? You're finally here at last. Welcome to the art challenge! I guess we better get started. First up, we have drum roll, please! A rainbow! 
Wow, I love rainbows. Let's just get on with this. I need something for my bag. Ooh, I'll check my bag. What have I got? That's your bag? Aha, I can use it for my drawing. Hey, I forgot I had this. Mmm, it still smells good. Are you kidding me? I'm gonna throw up. Eh, I'm just messing. I just need a pen. A diamond encrusted pen, of course. Ugh, where did this come from? Mmm, that gives me an idea. Hey, Kendall! Get it away from me! Oh, so gross. Okay, I'll start by folding the paper. I'll place the pencil tin on it and use it to draw a circle. Then I'll draw a face on it. I'll start with the eyes. I'll split the smile over the fold. What a lovely smile. Now I'll open the paper up. I'll use my money as a ruler. I'll join up the face. Then it's time to add some color. I want it to be as bright as possible. And I'll draw a rainbow inside the mouth. Now I can fold the paper back over. It looks great! Check it out! It's pretty good, huh? Wow! My jaw is dropping! Brittany hasn't even started yet. There must be something I can use. Oh hey, I found my old chalk. I can definitely use this. I just need my trusty hammer. I'll quickly make a butterfly stencil. I'll place it on a sheet of black card. Next, I'll put the chalk on it. And then, it's bashing time! Oh yeah, that feels good! This really works out my tension. Now I can remove the stencil. I'm left with a beautiful butterfly. Excellent work, girls! I know! It's such a tough decision, but Brittany wins! Really? Wow, thanks! Ugh, that's so unfair! Hey, I like your drawing. Hey, romance is in the air! Here's your next challenge. It's a love heart. And to inspire you, I have a special guest. Take a look over there! Hello, ladies. I call this my smoldering look. Gee, I'm so glad I brought that wind machine. Ah, he's cute. Hey, I saw him first! Nuh-uh! I need to win this round. I'll have to create something special. Give me the love hearts. I want more. I'm going as fast as I can. I'm not good under pressure. Here you go. This is just what I need. Brian is so dreamy. We'd be so happy together. Okay, let's do this. I'll start with a romantic message. I think that says exactly how I feel. Now I'll go around it with a gold pen. I'll add some stars. I wrote messages on the other hearts. Hmm, I think I'll choose this one. I'll fold the sides. And press them down to create a crease. Now I'll fold the top over. It makes a small envelope. I'll use a sticker to seal it. I'll put it with the rest. It's a little collection of love letters. It makes the cutest keyring. Whoa, that's pretty good. Hmm, this might be tougher than I thought. I'm struggling to think of something. Okay, here goes. I'll draw a love heart. But it's not a conventional love heart. It's different, but it looks good. Hello there. I'm loving the hobo look. And this drawing? C'est magnifique. A rose for a rose. Wow, such a gentleman. And what's this? Is that for me? Beautiful and talented. What a combo. I have something for you. Kill my heart! Yeah, I get that reaction a lot. Ahem. Anything for me? Be quiet, this is my time! This is handy. Just a little joke. The next challenge is… A brush. Uh, where's Brittany? Don't look at me. Whatever, let's start without her. Go ahead. This should be easy. Hello, I want an order. What great service. I love shopping. It's my favorite hobby. Okay, let's get this out of the box. How did it even fit in here? Ugh, it's heavy. But it's perfect. I don't need this box anymore. Sorry I'm late. <laughs> oh my gosh, is that toilet paper? Huh? What are you talking about? Oh, right. Oops. Well, that was embarrassing. So what did I miss? Wait. I just need to do something. <laughs> Please stop. Oh yeah, that feels good. Oh, I can use this. I don't need a paintbrush. I'll snap it in half. Then I'll roll it in toilet paper. I want to keep it nice and tight. Next, I'll wrap it in green plastic. Just like this. 
Once that's done, I need a sticker. This will hold it in place. It looks good. I'll place it into this clear tube. I think it's ready. I'll dip the first swab into pink paint. It matches the color of the plastic. And then I'll brush it onto the paper. When I'm done with that color, I just swap the swabs around. It's time for some blue. I'll let the paint absorb into the swab. And I can get back to creating my art. What the? So it's like that, is it? You ain't seen anything yet. I have big plans. I'm about to create a masterpiece. I'm finished! Uh… What? Why would you do that? You… Lose! Come on! The brush slipped! Sorry. Gotta keep my potassium levels up. This is the next challenge. All this work is making me hungry. Get me something to eat. Ooh, this is more like it. It all looks so delicious. What should I try first? Whoa. That does look good. I want it. Get your grubby hands off it. I don't want you touching my food. Come on, you won't eat all of it. Fine, I'll give you an egg. Catch. Whoa. Easy. Don't drop it. Phew. That was close. Thanks for this. I'll crack the egg into a bowl. I want to keep the yolk separate. I'll put that in another bowl. I'll use my fingers to break it. Hmm. It feels all slimy. <laughs> Next, I'll add a small amount of oil. Just a little more. Now I can stir it. Next, I'll fill a syringe with the mixture. It makes it easier to work with. And it's not as messy. I'll add the egg mixture to powdered paint. I don't need a lot. Just a few drops. I'll use a brush to mix the egg and paint together. That looks about right. Now I'll take the eggshell and crush it slightly. I want to break it into small pieces. I'll take this piece of the shell and I'll paint it blue. I love this color. I've drawn a vase and I'll stick the shell onto it. Then I'll add flowers. Mmm. I couldn't eat another bite. Wait. Maybe I eat too much. Whoa! Oops. My bad. Better out than in. I don't want to waste any food. Hmm. Maybe I can create something with it. I've painted a sheet of card blue. And I'll use the broccoli as a brush. I'll dab paint over the paper. I'll use different colors. It gives an amazing leaf effect. Check it out. Ooh, that's pretty. I love it. Very creative. How do I decide? It's tough, but Kendall wins! Yes! I'm the greatest! Okay, take it easy, Picasso. Whee! Look at it go! Take a look at your next challenge. How exciting! Are you kidding? I've no idea what we're supposed to do with that. Aw, there's a loose thread on my shirt. There's another one. That's all I need. Hmm, maybe these might come in useful. Ooh, makeup! Maybe Kendall won't notice. This is my chance. Just act natural. Nothing to see here. The perfect crime. I'll cover the thread in string. Then I'll put it on my notebook. I'll arrange it in a wave pattern. Then I'll close the notebook over. I'll pull the thread. It leaves behind an abstract painting. It looks great! Wow, that's actually quite impressive. Wait. Brittany! Yes? Oh, uh, how did that get there? Keep it. I'll use this brush. I'll paint my canvas black. But I'll stop halfway. Then I'll apply a line of glue. I'll brush the glue over the black paint and the blank canvas. Just like this. Before it sets, I'll sprinkle glitter over it. I need to be quick. Phew. This is hard work. Huh? Is that gold? That'll look great on my painting. Even my dandruff is rich. I should buy better shampoo, though. I'll place a heart stencil onto the canvas. And grab a can of spray paint. I'll go over the stencil with it. It's so vibrant! I'll carefully remove the stencil. Wow! I'd hang that on my wall. It's good, isn't it? Oh yeah. Wait until you see this. Whoa! My eyes! I can't see! Put it down! That's better. Wow! It's wonderful! It is pretty special. Give me a warning next time. Whoa! Look at all this stuff! That's the end of the challenge! It's time to announce the winner! Me! Me! Pick me! I'm so nervous! Who will it be? It's Kendall! I don't believe it! 
tried my best. Well done. Hmm. Wait. We should share the prizes. Really? You mean it? Woohoo! Uh, I'm not really a hugging person. It's so beautiful. Art is the real winner. Here I go. Ugh. Shoot, I missed. Here, let me try. Ugh. Boo, I missed two. Just gotta aim. It really shouldn't be this hard to get one in. Whoa, what the heck? Look what it's doing. <gasps> it's totally drawing a picture in that artwork. Ooh, that's not good. Oh no, the teacher is here. Hmm, what's going on in here? Ugh, what happened to that piece of art? That's it! Art power is go! Whoa, no way! Look at us! Wait, lipstick? Oops, sorry about that. I can fix it. There. <laughs> Much better. All right, we're totally ready to tackle a drawing challenge. I'll spin the wheel and see what you'll be facing. There we go. Oh, how sweet. A heart. Time to draw love. Yay! I love drawing hearts and love stuff. I know what I'm gonna do. I'll start with the word love. Hmm. Wow, that was a great day. She was so beautiful in that meadow. Okay, now to really zazz this picture up. I'll add a little heart and then turn the O into a girl. The V can be another heart, and the E can be the person she likes. So cute! But it needs more color. This heart should be pink. Good. And the little one up here should match too. Okay, now for some more colors. A purple dress. Wow! This is really turning into something special! Time to switch colors! Yellow for their hair! They match! And I think he's wearing a blue hat. Time for some green on his shirt! <laughs> no, I love you the most! These colored pencils will help give them expressions! Ta-da! Alright, students! Let's see your artwork, please! Uh, huh? W what? Oh no! Ew, keep the gum in your mouth, please! Um, what are you doing? Uh, just wait. This is my artwork, I promise. I just need one more moment. Almost done. I'm done. There. Here's my artwork showing love. Phew. Whoa! How did you even do that? Amazing! Oh my goodness. That is very impressive. Hi, Marks! I'm excited to see what's next. Oh, there goes the wheel. There we go. It's landed on a flamingo. Hmm, not exactly the most dynamic. What will you do? A flamingo? I don't think I've ever seen one in real life. Are you kidding me? I don't have high hopes for this challenge. What am I gonna do? They're pink, right? I think so. No, that idea won't work either. Ugh. Ugh. I can't stand it! I don't know what to do! Wait, what the heck is all over my hand? Is that paint? Man, now I've got pink paint all over my hand too! Ugh. Hey, wait a second. I think I have an idea. Let's see what happens if I start with a handprint. Whoa, that's pretty cool! And it gives me an idea too. I'm gonna start by tracing my hand. Now to adjust this outline. Gotta add an eye and beak. I'll color in the beak first, since it's black. And now to fill in the pink everywhere else. So much pink! I'll just keep going back and forth here with the color. It's a lot of pink for sure, but I'm getting there! Ooh, there's a pink highlighter in here. I'll need it. Time to turn my handprint into a tropical bird. I'm gonna turn my thumb into the head of the bird. There's the black beak. Now for the eyes and then the legs. There are skinny yellow legs. And I'm done! All right, class. Let's see your finished projects for Flamingo. <clears throat> Here's my picture of a flamingo. Here's mine too, ma'am. Just like you asked. I see we have a full body drawing and a head profile. You've both done an excellent job. Oh, right. You had paint all over your hand. Oh, <laughs> yes. Yeah, sorry about that. What do you think we'll get next? Oh. All right, you two. Are you ready? It looks like your selection this time is boy. I'm interested to see what you come up with. Hmm. I'm kind of bummed about this one. Not gonna lie. Huh? Oh no! I'm out of snacks! Now that's something to be bummed about. Well, now what am I gonna do? Hang on a second. I've got this empty plate now. Yep, this is totally gonna work. I've got a great plan. What are you even doing over there with that plate and marker? I don't get it. Why are you drawing on the plate like that? Don't worry about me. I know what I'm doing. Gonna just finish up my little stick man on this plate. 
Hmm, boy, what should I draw for that? I'll try with my words again. That seems to work well for me. Okay, there we go. Boy, now it's time to transform it. Give him some glasses and now some hair. Looking good. Can't forget your ear, though. Or his chin, nose, and mouth. All right, I've got my sick man. I think he needs a balloon, too. There. And he needs a string so the balloon doesn't fly away. Ugh. There's something in my teeth. It's obnoxious. No good. Maybe something to drink will help. Gulp. Hmm. Maybe a little better, I think. I think you need some orange hair. Just a little bit more and your hair will be good to go. All right. You want a green shirt? Sure thing. I'm done! <gasps> no! You spilled water all over my guy! He's drowning! I have to do something to save him! No, no, no! Stickman! Don't panic! Wait. Something's happening! Something's going on with my stick man! You're right! He can't drown because it floats! He's so cool! I love him! You did a great job! I win this one? No way! That's amazing! Okay, let's spin this wheel again. Aw, would you look at that! You got dog this time! I know what I'm gonna do. It's in my hat! What? A rubber chicken? Where did this come from? I know it's in here somewhere. Wait, is this what I need? Nah, I don't really play that much anymore. Come on, this hat can't be that big. <clears throat> is that a quarter? Is that what you were looking for? Oh, there's one for me too! Don't mind if I do! Phew! Who knew my hat could hold so many things? Okay, I need this pen. I don't get it. What are you doing with your coin over there? I'm using it as a tracing guide. I need a couple of circles. I don't get it. Wait, I know what to do! I hope you're all working hard over there! Okay, I'm gonna need my hoodie pulled over my head. I'll be right back. Hey there! How about I give you this and you lend me your dog? Thanks! Oh my gosh! Who's a cute little good boy? <sighs> my name is Patrick. Smile! I just need to get a couple of photos of you. You're so cute! You could be a model! Eee! Here you go! Thanks so much! Got my oval colored in except for that circle. I've added those little lines and dots. Now to draw his head. And some eyes, too. He's really starting to come together. Can't forget his ears, of course. A doggy needs his ears. And a body, too. And finally, his tail. Now to color him in. I think his ears need to be a brown color. And his feet and cheeks. Done! Phew! I made it back and no one noticed I was gone. Just gonna finish up right here. <laughs> Teacher, I'm done! Here's my picture of a dog! I'm done, too! Oh my gosh, look at that cute little angel face! You win! She didn't even draw that! We're ready for our next challenge! Oh, I love dance! Looks like you've got a ballerina! Wait, what? How are we supposed to work with that? Don't look at me, I've never even seen a ballet! Wait, I know! I'll need this paper. I can fold it in half like this. What are you doing over there, origami? That can be pretty neat. I know, but you have to make sure to fold the paper just right. I started with a center fold like this. Then again the other way. Open it up, fold down both the corners. Good. Then the bottom flap needs to come up on both sides. Yeah, this is going great so far. I love folding paper. These popped up corners need to go back down. Corners over here, too. Just a little more. Getting closer. These sides both have to fold up. There! I did it! I made a little boat out of my piece of paper! What do you think? Do you like it? There! Perfect! A pair of little paper sails for my boat. But how is it for dance? Oh, because a boat dances along the waves as it sails. Wait, what? That's seriously what you're going with? That's totally not gonna work! She's right, see? The picture is on a ballerina, not a boat. Uh, okay, fine. But I think I can still do something with origami. Are… are you just making another boat? Because again, won't work. No, it's not another boat. Look, I made a unicorn this time. Woo! You've got a unicorn! You're amazing! <laughs> Still isn't gonna count. Okay, you're right, but I've got this. Third time's the charm. I'll use two colors of paper this time. That'll help for sure. Hmm, what are you doing? Wow, this is hard. How are you doing that? You're going so fast! It's hard to keep up! Yes, I'm done! I made a beautiful rose! For you! It's so lovely! I can't believe you made this for me! But what the heck am I gonna do? <gasps> I know! I just need to start over with my folds! I'm gonna use the edge of this ruler to help keep my folds crisp. This part is a bit tricky. Gotta pop it out like this. 
and on the other side too. Okay, I need to add some artwork. Just gotta draw a cute little ballerina on my paper. She's so cute! Okay, but I need to draw other parts too. Gotta make sure she still has her face and hands here. And then do the same on the other side too. Once I'm done up there, I need to do the same thing with her leg flaps. I think I'll give her some colors so she's prettier. But I can't forget to color it on each of the flaps. And I think I'll finish her outfit with a blue tutu. That's cute! Blue over here and blue over there. Yes! I'm finished with mine! Ta-da! Here, let me show you how it works. If I take the flaps and fold them up and down, I can make her dance! <laughs> Look at her go! So beautiful! Whoa! Wow! What a spectacular job! You win! Yes! I knew I would! But 